quality attributes of ultra-high temperature treated model beverages prepared with fava bean protein concentrates. In this presentation, our goal is to offer you a quick summary of the research and conclusions. Please follow the links to review the research in further details. Thanks to all the authors and publishers for making this research public, thereby advancing science and innovation. The objective of this research was to develop a model fava bean drink with a high concentration of protein at more than 4% weight for weight. The protein molecular weights and frequency for both fava and soya were assessed using SDS page. Results showed similarities in the protein molecular weight of both fava and soya, mainly 11S globulin. Thus, fava can be considered as a potential soya replica in plant-based milk beverages. Oil and water emulsions at 5-8% to weight for weight available protein were prepared using fava bean protein concentrates or FPC, 1% sunflower oil, and 0.2% sunflower lecithin. These emulsions were used as model beverages and were further investigated for UHD processability, stability, and physiochemical properties. The physiochemical properties of emulsion at various processing stages viz. coarse emulsification, homogenization, and UHD were measured. An increase in the protein concentration and thermal treatment resulted in an increased oil dropout size, coalescence and flocculation, and protein aggregation. Lower protein concentrations, viz. at 5-6% showed greater negative zeta potential and thereby higher dispersibility through enhanced electrostatic repulsions than those of higher concentrations at 7-8%. Furthermore, an increase in protein concentrations and UHT treatment resulted in an increased creaming index. In total, 21 different volatile compounds were detected and quantified, representing different chemical classes, namely alcohols, aldehydes, ketones, esters, furans, and acids. These volatiles have major consequences for the overall flavor chemistry of the model beverage product. The formulation of protein and starch content in the fava bean protein as well as optimization of the emulsification and UHT procedures is required to achieve stable fava bean beverage systems. This study showed the potential for the application of fava beans as a protein source in UHT-treated lagoon-based beverages and identified areas for further development.